Hi there, Sandra Crow, registered holistic nutritionist from Fit Kitchen Diva. So the last few weeks in Ontario, we've had a crazy heat wave. It's been in the 40s with the humidity feeling like even more. So it's just been that kind of sticky, gross summer so far. So we need to make sure we stay hydrated. I ask my clients to drink at least two liters of water a day. I personally drink about three liters of water a day. But during a heat wave like that, we need to drink even more. The problem is people turn to sugary drinks like pops and juices, or what I think is even worse, the diet sodas, the things with the aspartame in it. Whole story about why I don't like aspartame, but let's just say it raises your insulin levels, which insulin tells your body to hold on to fat. So that's why people don't lose weight with diet drinks. So what else can we drink that's natural, that's calorie free, that's good for us, and that tastes great? I've got a few options for you. One of the easiest things is just infused water. So I've infused this water with lemon and basil. Tastes fantastic. And not only that, but we're getting the nutrients from the lemon. So we're getting lots of vitamin C because it leaches into the water. And also lemon is very alkalinizing to the body. So it's a great way to help stimulate digestion as well. And tastes amazing. There's also on the market now a lot of sparkling waters that are infused with flavor. And these are actually really good options because there's no sugar in it. Uh, Perrier has one of my favorites. It's a grapefruit one. I love that one. Uh, this one is just by our local grocery store, PC. It's a watermelon sparkling water. So just have a look to see at the sodium levels in, in the different ones. Some of them do have some sodium in them. Some of them have none at all. Because I do a lot of cycling, I actually purposely sometimes try to ingest extra sodium so I don't worry about it but if you're watching your sodium levels have a look at it so sparkling flavored fruit waters amazing calorie free and you wanted to say that it comes from natural flavors or how about just plain sparkling water, right? Sparkling water is a mineral water, which means it contains a mineral. This brand in particular, Gerolsteiner, is actually quite high in calcium and in magnesium. So it's just water that's been naturally sparkled. Um, some of them will have had uh, sparkles put into them. Some of them actually weirdly come out of the ground sparkly. I'm not sure how that one works. Um, but they are often higher in minerals, so good for us in other ways too. You could, if you want, add a little bit of juice to it just to add a little bit of pizzazz. This is one that you might not think of. I discovered this actually in Mexico. I was at a spa and they were serving a mint flavored water. And I learned that it's liquid green. So this is chlorophyll water. So you add about a tablespoon of this to water and very alkalinizing to the body. Keeping in mind an acidic body is very prone to disease. An alkaline body resists disease. And this is made with chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is what gives plants their structure, keeps them green, keeps them healthy does the same thing for us but does not turn us green. Um, this one is mint flavored so I find it's got a really nice refreshing taste to it. So just a tablespoon of that into water, healthy awesome drink and it's almost like a greens powder where you're getting extra nutrients and vitamins. This is one that when I make my kids actually really love because who doesn't like iced tea, right? But we don't want the sugar of iced tea. So I'll usually use an herbal tea. This one is a peach herbal tea. I find berry herbal teas are great. I boil water and I put in a couple of tea bags of a fruit flavored type tea into a pitcher and it goes into the fridge to cool down. But I will add either a little bit of honey or a little bit of stevia just to sweeten it. And it really does taste like a delicious peach iced tea or a raspberry iced tea. So those are some good options. Here's another one I really like. Where is it in the camera? Watermelon. Watermelon is a fruit, great to hydrate us, great to eat because it's full of water, but even better, put it in your blender, add just a little bit of water, the watermelon chunks in your blender, maybe add some mint sprigs or some basil sprigs, and you have a watermelon slushy. So these are all healthy ways to hydrate, low or no calorie ways to hydrate. Most of them are giving us nutrients as well. One last way that I love to hydrate, especially after a workout, is by a company called Canprev. It's called Electromag, and it has electrolytes in it. So even better on a hot day when we've really been sweating. But what I love about it is not just the electrolytes, but it has magnesium in it, a mineral most of us are deficient in, and it also has vitamin C. So the, the magnesium helps with muscle relaxation. The vitamin C, it's a great antioxidant. So you basically just take a pouch, it comes in little sachets, and you mix it with a cup 
to two of water and you have a really refreshing lime flavored drink. I think my mom said she likes to drink it in the hot tub. <laughs> um, and again, a lime flavored, refreshing drink, really good for you. And it's sweetened with a little bit of stevia and xylitol. So again, calorie free, aspartame free. So I've given you a bunch of different things that you can drink on a hot day or really just any day that give you some flavor, because we want that flavor from time to time. Water is great, but we don't want it all the time. That give you some flavor, but also are giving you nutrients, vitamins, minerals, greens, chlorophyll, alkaline. So these are all really good for you. So try one or two. Let me know what you think about it. Here's an even better deal, the Electromag. If you go to tryelectromag.ca, they will send you one of these pouches as a sample for free. So you can give it a try and I know you'll love it just like I do. Try them, let me know how you like them. Remember to subscribe or even better go to my website, fitkitchendiva.com and sign up for my blog and get a free three-day sugar-free menu challenge. Thanks and keep healthy.